This program made possible by Stephen Silver Fine Jewelry, a global jewelry company based in the heart of Silicon Valley, strategically advising families and individuals in the procurement and sale of precious gemstones, estate, and fine jewelry for over four decades. It was a showpiece from the moment that they built it. It was the largest private home west of the Mississippi. I believe there's 1.3 million cubic feet of space in this house. It's not the most practical thing to have a house that has over 90 rooms. This building is a window to a whole other period in American history. A house is a kind of three-dimensional history. It's been sold and bought and given back again. Some people say that there is a curse on this house. It's often said that there was a murder in this house. All kinds of outrageous claims about this building. Haunted mansion up in Hillsborough. Anybody with any children would say, my God, our kids go up there all the time. Let's face it, Carol Ann's was a community eyesore for many years. It looked like the wart on the end of somebody's nose. A house of this size attracts envy. I think it was built to attract envy. Money should show itself in truly grand architecture like this. If ever there was an American Downton Abbey, this is it. Chateau Carolans. A 98-room mansion with a 98-year history. An architectural masterpiece dreamed by an heiress. Where a man might leave his mark in politics or industry, the heiress made her legacy her home. Pouring her fortune into a chateau of extraordinary beauty. So graceful. So grand attracting both wealth and ruin. <laughs> <laughs>